Hey, it's Gordy here from Johnson Controls. We're in Niagara Falls, Canada. We're going to take Power G, shoot it over the falls, and back. We're actually going to set up a full Power G system. Rather than just showing you the strength and the range of one Power G device, we're going to set up a system. IQ4 panel on the Canadian side, and we're going to take a remote Power G keypad over to the US side. We're also going to take the wire to wireless translator module, and we're going to put that on the US side as a sub panel. We're going to be able to arm the system from the US side. We're going to turn on lights from the Canadian side, and we're going to have literally a full system set up, locking, turning on lights, arming, disarming from both sides of the border. A true international system. Okay guys, you got your passports? Steve and Jowie are on their way. They're going across the border on the bridge. Looking forward to them set up right across here. Here we go. Excellent. They're across the border, guys. Now we went with GCI security products. We're on the U.S. side of Niagara Falls with some power G range tests. Power G everywhere works. All right, we got the maid of the mist down there. The rainbows are coming out soon. Boys are over there. We saw them flash the light, giving us the signal that they're on site. So now here we go. Test is coming. That is outside of the one, one kilometer. Yeah, but we do 6,000 line of sight. The device is offline. Does it take a while for it to learn? Took a little while. Maybe not quite this long. IQ lock power G unlock. Oh baby! <laughs> <laughs> That's further than I've ever seen anything transmit. Oh, the lights are in range now. Now we go, baby. And we gotta back them up, boys. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have the power G keep that over there too? See if you can arm it too. Uh, let me see if it's in range. It looks like it's in range. If you guys wanna try to arm the panel, go ahead, does it stay? Select arm system type. Arm stay. I was IQ me. hardwired <laughs> bypass. <laughs> you just arm the keypad from the other side of Niagara Falls. No, no. From a different country. From a different country. Yeah, from a different country. <laughs> it's the first international panel. It's now disarmed. <laughs> okay, guys, uh, can you just uh, arm the panel from the U.S.? Select arm system type. Away mode selected. Away mode selected. IQ hardwired bypass. Wow, it's arm. 10. Hey, Gordy, can you guys disarm? I'm going to disarm. System is now disarmed. System is disarmed over there. I can hear it as well. That's fantastic. That's a perfect fix. Wired to wireless from country to country. Wow. IQ lock power G unlocked. Yeah. Can you unlock it? Okay, hey guys, I'm going to turn your lights on over there. Okay, I'm going to turn them off. So, theoretically then, this is with the IQ4 pen. Right. And we're getting strong signal across to the U.S. We're over a kilometer, easily. Over 3,000 feet. Yep. With the IQ hardware, yep. so there's sub panel. Yep. If we put that under an IQ Pro with a host and a repeater, theoretically, we would get double this distance. More than that. Because this Probably is more than that. The host would have a higher transmission power than the onboard. What we just accomplished is absolutely unbelievable. We went from country to country, arming a panel, disarming a panel, turning lights on, turning locks on. Unbelievable. Power G everywhere. It works.